Okay, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. This is the graphics program in C, where I have included the graphics.h, and I send, I'm saying two variables, integer type gd and gm. Uh, gd is going to detect means get the best graphics driver automatically and drop it in the gd, and gm is a graphics mode. And when you say detect, uh, use a detail that's macro in the graphics.h, uh, then automatically here, the gm will be, you know, initialized with the best graphics driver, and here I'm actually an array with some vertices. The, these are the X and Y pairs of vertices. And I'm saying that's a word I'm saying. I got uh, three vertices, one, two, and three. This is the repetition of uh, the first. And what I'm saying is initialize graph. So I have to go from character mode to the graphics mode. And then I'm pushing GD so, so that I can get the best graphics driver in here, GD, and in GM. And I, I have to give the path of the you know, uh, BGI library. Okay, so I have got a function called draw poly in the graphics.h in which I select four vertices and vert. Vert here is this one, or I can use uh, these uh, dimensions here. You know, 200, 100. I start from the 200x, 100y. Then I go to the 100x, and that means I go a little bit here. If it is, for example, 200x and 100y, I go to the 100x, means here, and 300y. So, so on the bottom, and then 200x. So I move on to the 200x, okay, uh, and then 300 on the same length. Or I could have put more here to get it more centralized, you know. Okay, should I move um, on? Um, if my mouse is going like this, okay. How to get the mouse in? Okay, the mouse problem is there. See all that. And you can see we got the triangle here. I start from the 200 and then 100, and then I got I got some here, the lesser x. It was a, the x was 200 here, x is 100, and then move on to the the y position down a little bit up to 300. Then I come back to the this position because I said x 200 and uh, x 200 gone here and y same as this much, okay, and. Uh, then back to the original point or I could have gone more here so that it would be more symmetrical okay now what I'm doing is I'm, I'm putting over here 300 300 okay so it gives a little, little, little bit symmetrical now run it you get a symmetrical triangle right so you got a triangle um, so what I'm now here having here is a uh, I want to fill the color. I'm saying say first the set color style. That's two. This, this two is the uh, what kind? Like uh, we have a solid color, we have a hash it, we have dash it, a lot, a lot more. And these guys uh, are about colors. Okay, they run up to the 15. You know that. And uh, this uh, you know the solid fill and all. They will run I guess up to the 12. There may be solid fill, line fill, slash fill. You can run up to zero up to uh, you know twelve. Uh, some and uh, zero up to this much of colors. So I have to do what? Um, 
what you see now is uh, the color is some some different and this is the because as a two uh, in the shape okay, let's go to the style that means lion tail okay if you want to say solid field then should be one or maybe different color also right now you see uh, because I said one as a pin color color so it, it's, it's becoming uh, the white and uh, white because of 15 and solid fill because of uh, one similarly we can have a 14 uh, 0 up to 12 stuff here right and um, so we can animate the user maybe maybe some forward look and all so we can animate it okay but I have problem with the recorder so I had a first pause because if I resume it, I go here, the mouse is not working, so I may not be showing you the uh, animation. So, better you do what? You go and uh, do use the far loop and change the color of the fit style using the eye. Okay, I maybe I and J values uh, one for the uh, fit style and one for the color. That will a lot of animations. Okay. I'm, ha I'm having a circle here at 300 200 of uh, ready 60 but if I give it a go you can see the circle is there but there's no color so I, I'm not having anything like uh, a fill circle like I made a fill poly right and um, there may be also some irregular shapes so when we, we can't have uh, you know to fill we can't fill the colors so if you want to fill the colors in the situation you have to use a fluid fill what you do is you will Give some point inside the circle anywhere where you like, and then fluid fill does what? Whatever the color the your fill style has, or your set color, maybe you have them the set color. Okay, that uh, fluid fill will fill that this thing up to the whatever uh, when then some color comes up. You say for the color comes up white, and it goes up to the white. Okay. Okay. So this is this is the way to fill the, some irregular shape or say circle in. Uh, first thing is to say set fill style. This means uh, the one is solid, and three means something like you know, uh, sometimes some different color. And set color white means uh, this the color uh, of a line of a circle, right? Line color of a circle is white. And I'm drawing a circle 300, 260 radius, 300 x, 200 y, and 60 radius. And I'm saying fluid fill and give some point. I, I not necessarily that I get the center. I get any point within a circle, and it starts expanding. It starts covering until it doesn't. Uh, you know, it didn't. It, it will not get the color, this white color, unless it doesn't get the white color. That's why I have I have write this. Uh, you know, same color here because if you don't get the color white, it will start covering what is specified here this three color that's right it starts covering uh, everything uh, by with this color whatever, whatever the color is this three black or white whatever it is now uh, therefore we have to set color of a circle white so that we, we are saying it that uh, start painting from this position and um, in all directions okay unless we do not get this color so if you have an irregular shape and uh, no matter what, what what irregular how much irregular it is no problem because you give a point and start painting everywhere in every direction unless it doesn't get the uh, the line color white color or it may say red color no problem so that, that if you see a red color it should be red here right so I get to go control F9 Right. My mouse problem. I had to pause my video first. Okay, as you can see now, my circle set color has been what? It has colored the circle white, and I get the points and point inside circle. And so say this. This is this greenish color is a three. So what I'm saying is, uh, paint this unless you don't find this white color. So wherever this white color is, it stop there. It may be some irregular shape, no problem, and it will do it. So, fluid fill is a better option to fill up the irregular shapes. You get me? So, this can also give me uh, this is a lot like my like my face. Okay, so let's make a color out of it. Put a triangular cap on it, and draw lines here, and make a color out of it. Right? Maybe then we animate it. So, 
design a card room. Okay, that's your job today. See you on the next time. Masalam.